myself, M. A. Mahant, working in Computer Science and Engineering Department as an assistant professor in Walchen Institute of Technology, Solapur. So today we are going to discuss the topic components of IT infrastructure. Learning outcomes. At the end of this session, student will be able to describe about the components of IT infrastructure and describe the current trends in computer hardware platforms. Now, first of all, we are going to see components of IT infrastructure. So, IT infrastructure today is composed of sev uh, seven major components. These components constitute investments in the uh, that must be co coordinated with one another to provide the film with a current infrastructure. In the past, technology vendors supplying these uh, components were often in competition with one another, offering purchasing firm a mixture of uh, incompatible proprietary partial solutions. But increasingly, the vendor firm have been forced by a large customer to cooperate the strategy partnership with one another. So, firm uh, so worldwide are expected to spend uh, six. Uh, 69 dollars billions of dollars on computer hardware devices in 2014 including mainframe server pcs tablets and smartphones so this is the diagram of the it infrastructure ecosystem where the first element is operating system where uh, this uh, microsoft windows unix linux Mac. OS X, Chrome, Android, iOS, these are a different operating system. Next, next is enterprise resource application, including the SAP, Oracle, Microsoft, IBM. Next part is networking and telecommunication, where Microsoft, uh, Windows Server, Linux, Cisco, AT&T and Verizon are there. Concert, next is consultant and system integra integrators, where IBM, HP and Accenture is there. Next uh, uh, part of this ecosystem is data management where IBM DB2, Oracle, SQL servers, likewise the many others there. So uh, in next is internet platform where Apache, Unix, Cisco, Java, uh, Microsoft, IIS.NET is there. And next is computer hardware platform, Dell, IBM, uh, Oracle, Sun, HP and Apple are shown in the figure. So these, uh, there are seven major components that must be coordinated to provide the firm with the current IT infrastructure listed here are major technologies and suppliers for each component. Now first of all we are going to see the first element that is the operating system platform. So Microsoft Windows Server comprises about 35% of the server operation system market with 65% of uh, corporate servers uh, using some form of Unix operating system or Unix and inexpensive and robot open source relative of Unix. So Microsoft Windows Server is capable of providing the enterprise wide operating system and network services and Apple's to organization and seeking the Windows based IT infrastructures. So Unix and Linux are scalable, reliable and much more less expensive than mainframe operating system. Next is enterprise software application. So firm worldwide are expected to spend about uh, 320 billion of dollar in net to the 14 on software for enterprise application that are treated as a component of IT infrastructure. So the largest provider of the enterprise application software is SAP and Oracle. The next is data management and storage. So uh, enterprise database management software is responsible for uh, organizing and managing the firm's data so that the they can be uh, efficiently accessed and used. The leading database software provider IBM DB2, Oracle, Microsoft, SQL Server, Sybase uh, with which supply more than 90% of the uh, US database software marketplace. Next is net, uh, network and telecommunication platform. So companies worldwide are expected to spend uh, 1.65 trillion of dollar for telecommunication services in 2014. Windows Server is predominantly used as a local area network operating system followed by the Linux and Unix. Large enterprise wide networks uh, use the some variant of Unix. Most of the local area network as well as wide area network enterprise networks and TCPIP protocols uh, suit a standard. The leading networking hardware uh, provider are Cisco, the 
Akatil, uh, Lucent and uh, Ju uh, Jupiter Networks. The next one is internet platform. Internet platforms uh, overlap with and must relate to the firm's general networking infrastructure and hardware and software platform. They include hardware, software and management services to support the firm's website including web hosting services, router and call cabling or wire uh, wireless equipment. The next is consulting system and integration services. So include the Accenture, IBM Global uh, Services, HP, Infosys, Wipro Technology, software integration means uh, ensuring the new infrastructure works with the firm's older uh, so-called legal system or ensuring the new elements of the infrastructure work with the one another. So legal systems are generally older transaction processing system created for uh, mainframe computer that continue to be used to avoid the high cost and replacing or uh, redesign them. So replacing these uh, system to cost prohibitive and generally not uh, necessary if these older systems can be integrated into a contemporary infrastructure. Next is current trends in computer hardware platform. The exploiting power of computer hardware and networking technology has dramatically changed. Now business orga organization organize their uh, computing power putting more than this power on network and mobile handheld devices. Next is mobile digital platform. So new mobile and digital uh, computing platform have m um, emerged as alternative PCs and large computers. Smartphones such as uh, iPhone, Android and Blackberry smartphones have taken uh, on many functions PCs including the transmission of data, surfing web, transmitting email and instant messages, displaying the digital content and exchanging the data and the uh, internal corporate system. The next one is consumerization of IT and void. The popularity, ease of use and rich array of useful application for smart and tablet uh, computers have the uh, created a ground of in interest of the following uh, allowing employees to use their personal mobile device in, wor in the workplace. A phenomenon popularity called the bring your own device. So void is the one of the aspect of of consumerization of IT in which the new information technology that first emerges in the consumer market spread into the business organization. Next is quantum computing. Quantum computing is the emerging technology with the potential to dramatically boost the computer processing power to find the answers problems that would uh, take conventional computers many years to solve. Quantum computing uses the principle of computing physics to represent data and perform operation on this data. The next is cloud computing. So cloud computing is a model of computing in which computer processing, storage, software and other services are provided as a pool of virtualization and uh, resource over a network, primarily the internet. The US national uh, Institute of Standard and Technology defines the cloud computing having the following essential characteristics. First is on-demand self-service, consume can obtain computing capabilities. Second, the ubiquitous network access, cloud resource can be accessed during using st standard network and internet devices. Location independent resource pooling. The next one is rapidly uh, elasticity for computing resources and rapidly provisioned increased and decreased to meet the changing user demand. Major, next is major services charges for cloud uh, resources be based on amount of resources to be used. So cloud computing having different types of uh, uh, services. The first is infrastructure as a service. Uh, the customer uses a processing storage, networking and other uh, computing resources for, uh, from cloud services providers to run the, their information system. Second platform as a service. Here customer uses uh, infrastructure and programming supported by the uh, service, cloud service provider to develop their own applications. Next as software as a service, here customer uses service hosted by the vendor on a vendor's cloud in infrastructure and delivered over a network. 
सो देर इज अ प्राइवेट क्लाउड ओन्ड बाय एंड मेन्टेन्ड बाय अ क्लाउड सर्विस प्रोवाइडर सच एज एमेजॉन वेब सर्विस अ पब्लिक क्लाउड इज मेन इज a public cloud is uh, owned and maintained uh, by a cloud service provider such as amazon web services and made by available to general public a private cloud is, is uh, operated solely by the organization the next part is green computing so uh, here by curbing hardware proliferation and power consumption virtualization become one of the more principal technology for uh, promoting the green computing green computing or green it refers to the practical technologies for designing manufacturing using the disposing uh, or of computers servers and associated drivers such as monitors printer storage device and the networking and communication system to minimize the impact of environment next is high performance and power uh, saving processor so so here a multiple uh, multi core processor is an integrated circuit to which uh, two or more processor have the to been attached for the enhanced performance reduced power consumption and more simultaneous processing for multiple task now i'm going to ask one question to all the students it infrastructure today is composed of dash major components so option a is uh, C one option B five option three C three option D eight. The correct answer is C one. So IT infrastructure today is composed of C one major components. These are the references. Thank you.